what's up you guys welcome and welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is joy praise and if you're already a subscriber you know you know it's your girl joy praise yo i know you love ghana and i know you want to go to ghana or you're planning a trip to ghana that's why you are on the internet googling searching about Ghana searching every day about Ghana yo don't worry I'm here to answer the most internet search about Ghana so if you're planning a trip to Ghana or you have a Ghanaian friend and you want to know more about Ghana so that you can have a good conversation with him or her yo don't worry I'm here for you and I'm gonna answer all the questions for you without further ado let's start so yo i have my phone here and uh, i'm just gonna type in it's ghana it's ghana yes it's ghana so let's see what we have here Woo! 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 okay what is the biggest problem in Ghana? <laughs> well, I would say our biggest problem in Ghana is bad governance. Yeah, that's what I would say. Our biggest problem in Ghana is our bad leaders. Our bad leaders are our biggest problem because, yo, Ghana is like, 63 years old mm. and we still it feels like we are still under our colonial masters so i would say the biggest problem in ghana is our bad leaders yes yes hands down and um hmm. is ghana dangerous oh no 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 Ghana is not dangerous, but uh, I would say uh, in every country we have some places that are dangerous, same as Ghana. So I think that's why it's good to have uh, an expert or to, to, to know someone in everywhere you go, you know, or anywhere you go. Sorry, anywhere you go. So uh, Ghana is not dangerous, no, Ghana is one of the most freely enjoyable, you know, like. The most sauciest you know what i'm saying the people there are so you know open they are so open and uh, so welcomed so ghana is not dangerous no it's not dangerous it's not dangerous no 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 but there are certain places that are dangerous that you know uh even me being Ghanaian, um i will never pass by that area or maybe cross that area so yeah but apart from that and I think every country has that you know there are certain places in every country that they will tell you yo don't go there don't pass there because that place is dangerous and same as Ghana so apart from that Ghana is not dangerous Ghana is not dangerous trust me Ghana is not dangerous um <laughs> what what is ghana famous food oh ghana famous food of course jollof rice jollof rice jollof rice fufu mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. oh my god i miss my fufu i have to go back to my country so fufu, jollof rice fufu wache uh banku yes I'm starving. I'm starving. Banku and um, Tiozafi. Oh my gosh, Tiozafi. Oh, I'm starving. I'm starving. Tiozafi is also one of the most uh, uh, famous food in uh, Ghana. So I um, I hope you try it. Whatever you visit Ghana, try it. Or if you have a Ghanaian restaurant, wherever you are, you're going to try these foods. And trust me. It's bomb. Some people might say, oh, jollof 
that thing Nigerian jollof, please no, no, Ghanaian jollof. Yeah, I mean Ghanaian jollof, the best jollof in the world, Ghanaian jollof. So Ghana jollof, so please, um, these are the famous food in Ghana, and trust me, they are yummy, yummy. Next is the snowfall in Ghana. Hell no, hell no. No, 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 no. Ghana, we have two seasons, dry season and uh, wet season, so there's nothing like snow, no, no. Next, is Ghana expensive? Well, I think if you want it to be expensive, it will be expensive. And if you want it to be cheap, it will be cheap. Because let's say you are maybe a foreigner and um, or maybe you are living in Ghana. Instead of you to go to the local market, like Cantamato or Makola to get your food stuff, you rather go to the mall to get it. For sure, it will be expensive. But for me, I will go to the local market, Mak uh, Makola or Cantamato, maybe um, Kedetia to get my stuff and just take it home, wash it and keep it. Instead of going to the mall because, yo, when you go to the mall, it will be high price than the um local market so i think if you want it to be expensive to be expensive for you and if, if you want it to be cheap it will be cheap but when it comes to maybe uh you know maybe um you are a foreigner and going to ghana i think you need to you you want to stay in maybe uh a high neighborhood so the rent the rent will be a little bit high and um because you don't know the local market you might be going to the mall to get your groceries i think that's when you find ghana expensive but i think when you manage or you calculate your things it will be a little bit less for you yo i can't believe people really google all these things like yo 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 Things about fufu 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 fufu, yo fufu everywhere fufu 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 fufu. I think this will be the last question I will answer. It says, "Is Ghana a poor country? What are you telling me? Ghana, we produce gold, we produce cocoa, and you are telling me we are poor." As I said in earlier, if we are poor, it's all because of our leaders. You know what I'm saying? But Ghana is not really poor. Ghana is not poor. No, Ghana is not poor. And if you think we are poor, I don't blame you. I blame our leaders because they made us poor. They made us poor because, I'll put it on the screen, Ghana is, we are one of the countries that, you know, produce good gold and, um, Coco and other stuff, so I'll put it on the screen. So please, Ghana is not poor, okay? Ghana is not poor. No, no. You just go and um, and uh, see it yourself. And if you think, okay, I think this will be in the next video. Someone asked me something about Ghana, and um, I was like, someone literally, let me say this, someone literally asked me, do you eat with spoons and fork in Ghana? And I was like, Hello, are you talking to me? Are you talking to me? W T F. Yo, so Ghana is not poor as you think it is. No. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope I helped you get more ideas about Ghana. And I hope I answered most of the questions for you. The questions you are dying to know thank you so much for watching and please stay safe and stay positive don't forget to visit ghana and when you visit ghana take a picture post it on instagram and tag me i am underscore j p e p joy praise Efia Pokia. so thank you so much for watching and uh, till next time adios <laughs> Wait, don't go. Ghana is beautiful. Ghana is beautiful. And they are so welcomed. <laughs>